Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Tasha. So today is July 10th and today is the day that I have movers coming to this apartment to move all of my main furniture to my new apartment. So today is really the big day and this will be the last day that I'm actually physically living in this apartment because once obviously my bed and everything is in the new place, then I will be staying there. If you guys haven't watched my previous moving videos, I will link those down below in the description. So my parents are actually here. They have been staying at my new place. So I'm gonna go over and pick them up in just a few minutes, but I wanted to show you guys kind of how my apartment is looking. We don't have movers coming until two and it's like 10 ish right now but this place is kind of a disaster <laughs> so i'm gonna show you it so you guys can kind of get an idea of what we're working with here's my bed all of the pillows are over here in bags and boxes and there's just a bunch of stuff all over my couch this comforter i washed yesterday so that's just sitting there and then everything else i guess in here looks fairly normal you know and then moving out here this is my closet this is a lot of stuff that i wanted to donate to goodwill but right now goodwill is not accepting donations near me so i'm kind of just holding on to those and then out here it's just some more boxes and my shelf has been cleared off there was like a hole in the wall that i patched so that's what that is and this is my kitchen situation so we still have the dishes that we want to put into boxes and stuff like that but that is basically <laughs> what my apartment is currently looking like and i'm sure i'll be doing a little bit more work with my parents when they get here i am paying the movers hourly so i want it to be as quick of a process as possible but i definitely didn't want to do too much work because that's also why i'm hiring movers so yeah the plan today is to get this stuff moved over and then at 7 p.m i'm actually picking up a purchase that i made on facebook marketplace i mentioned this in another one of my videos but I ordered this TV stand sideboard thing that I'm obsessed with but now it's on back order until October and I was planning on using that as a TV stand but since I don't have that coming until October I wanted to get something affordable in the meantime so I found a TV stand on Facebook marketplace for 50 bucks I feel like that was a pretty decent deal for what it is and I will probably just resell it once the one that I ordered comes but my dad and I are going to pick that up around 7 and hopefully try and get that into my car so those are the plans for today and of course i will document the process i'm currently sweating so much i love the ac in my new place it's gonna be incredible but yeah i will update you guys when anything exciting happens the movers are currently inside and i'm just outside to kind of be out of their way but i will show you guys the place when it's all emptied out it is now a lot later and all of my stuff is moved into the new apartment i had originally planned on kind of filming the movers moving but i just thought i don't know that's kind of like an invasion of their privacy to just film them so i decided against that but i just kind of wanted to show you how everything is looking right now and then my dad and i also picked up that tv stand that i purchased on facebook marketplace so i'll show you guys that but it's already looking really good i mean obviously stuff is everywhere but i'm so excited with how much space there is and how it's looking so let me show you guys what it looks like right now this is kind of an overflow area. My parents are out on the balcony right now, but this is a really <laughs> kind of messy spot. But this is the current living room situation. I've mentioned this in other videos, but I did order a bigger cream colored sectional that's going to go right here from West Elm, but that was being custom made and it won't be ready until next month. So for the meantime, I'm just gonna have my pink couch out here and my matching chair. And then once the bigger couch does come, I will be moving this couch into one of the bedrooms. I also need to get a coffee table. This is just here in the meantime, but this is what we're working with. And then this is the TV stand that I got on Facebook marketplace once again I'm only going to have this here until the one I actually ordered comes I do think it's really nice though and I'm also thinking that maybe I'll just put it here under the window once the other one comes and I can put plants on it and stuff but this is where my plants and table are and then going down the hallway this bedroom just has a ton of stuff in it this is going to be a lot of the organization so I have my clothing rack my shoe rack and then just a bunch of boxes a bunch of overflow there is the air mattress 
and yeah kind of a lot but it won't be horrible and then here is my bedroom this is where i decided to put my bed right now i just have the mirror in that corner the chair is just kind of sitting over here some of the drawers my bedding this will be going in a closet and this is just kind of how the room looks so that is where we are currently at i'm not sure how much work will be done tonight we'll probably just start placing things kind of where i want them to go i think tomorrow we might be going to costco because i need to get a tv i actually do not have a tv so we might be doing that and i know we are probably going to be doing a home depot run as well i want to get some more plants for the balcony and then my dad is actually going to build me a new shelf for above my couch if you guys watched my previous apartment tour my dad had built me a shelf and that one was just going to be a little bit too small for this apartment so we left that shelf for the person that moves in to my place next but we are going to build a bigger shelf so i'm excited about that we need to get that stuff at home depot but that was the update of what my place looks like now and i will check in with you guys when something else happens so the two boxes came from cb2 this long one and then this square one so we're gonna put these together and make the shelf we have the pieces taken out of the box and this is what they're looking like so next step is to put everything together all right so here's the finished product i still have to style it and everything and get some stuff for the shelves but the microwave fits perfectly and i also think that the shelves match these shelves pretty perfectly so very happy with this i will link it down below i showered and put some makeup on as well as this little dress it's just comfy and flowy i actually thrifted this but the current plan is i know we are going to go to my previous apartment because I need Wi-Fi to upload the previous moving vlog and the Wi-Fi situation here is not great. I can't have anyone install anything until the 18th and now it's like the 11th. So I'm gonna have a week here without Wi-Fi. I'm sure I'll figure something out, but yeah, I wanted to go over there just to get the Wi-Fi and then we're just gonna vacuum a little bit and clean out the rest of the stuff that we left there. I'm cutting out my roots because <laughs> they're so dark. But anyways, I will keep you guys posted. Oh, and I ended up moving the dresser from there to in front of my bed as well as this little storage thing. I moved it over and I think this makes a lot more sense. Obviously, there's clutter all over and I will style these a lot cuter, but I just think this makes more sense and there's a lot more open space over here now. to 6 p.m. and we went to Costco and actually got a TV and then we went to Home Depot. You guys saw me having a great time in the plant section. I will show you guys the stuff that we got in those places once I get back to my new apartment. After those places, we came to my old apartment just to get some more stuff that we left here and I also vacuumed up the floors a little bit. So I'm going to show you what it looks like now. Not everything is gone. As you can see, we still have some cleaning supplies here and stuff to clean a little bit more when we leave. I know my landlord here is still gonna get a cleaning person once i move out so that's why i'm not trying to make everything completely spotless but i'll show you how it looks it's so weird to see this place pretty empty so yeah these counters are pretty much the only spot where i still have stuff and then here was my little main room i am just leaving that shelf up for the next tenant and then in here you can see how dark it is in here in comparison to my new place it's crazy but there's my closet there's my old bathroom and then here is the big empty room and i hooked up the wi-fi stuff because i had to upload my video so we're just gonna leave this plugged in until we actually get everything out in a day or so but yeah here is my big empty giant bedroom i'll probably never have a bedroom this big again we have a ton of stuff loaded into my car so i'm gonna drive us over to the new place we're gonna unload all of that and I will catch you guys up on the stuff that we got and what we're gonna be doing next. Hi guys, so it is I think a day later since I last vlogged. I'm not completely sure. 
I look very beautiful <laughs> right now. I have not gotten ready today. I didn't vlog yesterday and we did do some things. I just figured I would rather show you guys progress as we go and my parents are kind of camera shy so I don't really think they want to be in the videos. So this is just the easiest way I think I'll do it but I wanted to show you guys some of the stuff that we have gotten and some of the progress that has been made. It's currently Monday, so if that gives any sort of context, I don't know if it will. So here's that CB2 shelf once again. I think I already showed you this. I like the plants on this shelf. I didn't put those ones up there. My mom has just kind of been putting stuff places, so those will not be there. This I need to return, so that's why that's sitting there. That won't be there, but I did get this little ZZ plant from Home Depot, and my mom helped me plant it in this pot that I previously had these little cacti in that died. <laughs> so I just have that there. I think it looks really cute. I'm going to move these plants eventually once I find a place for them. This area looks pretty much the same, still pretty messy over here. But then we did buy this giant plank board that we're gonna use as a shelf up here. I know it's a lot different color than the floor in this thing, but that is because I wanted something that would match the media stand that I actually bought. Ideally that will come in October and then it will match this shelf really well. So that's why I opted for a color like this. This room is kind of where my parents have been keeping their stuff and it's still a little bit <laughs> of a mess, but I ended up moving my desk and my makeup kind of drawer thing in here. So this will kind of be a get ready room, an office, an overflow area, just a bunch of stuff in here. And this is how my bedroom is coming along. I don't have all my pillows on my bed or anything, but my dad helped me hang my mirror above my bed. For people asking, I got this on Walmart's website. I'm not sure if it's still available. If it is, I will link it, but we put that above my bed. We got this super long curtain rod so that I could hang my curtains up because these are my blackout curtains from my last place and they're awesome. I originally had my desk over here but I decided I don't really like how it looks so I think I'm actually going to bring my pink couch in here and put it here because there's plenty of room for it to be here and the drawers and my bed will still open and I will be able to enjoy it more and then my bedroom can be more of just like a lounging room. And then here is what this area looks like. I don't love this dresser. I think sometime in the future I would like to get a new one but I am debating buying some little pull things and installing them on this just to kind of upgrade it a little bit. But that is what this area is looking like. I still have some stuff to put away and organize in here. But overall, it's coming together and it's looking a lot better. I want to get maybe a taller plant to put over here. But that is currently what we're working with. <laughs> this is what I look like right now. But what we're trying to get done today is put the shelf up. I also want to put that pendant light up. My parents hate that and they think it's gonna look horrible, but <laughs> I have the vision in my head. So we're gonna do that. And then I also ordered a towel bar from Amazon that came yesterday. So we're gonna put that up in the second bathroom. So I think those are the main things we wanna get done today. And then I think we might go to the beach later. So that was my little update and I will continue to update you guys as more things happen. The shelf is up and I'm gonna start putting some of my pictures on it. So I just styled some of the shelf with the things that I had up there before and I added an extra plant and then I moved this couch out to where my other couch will be. And my other couch is going to be a little bit taller too. So I think it looks really nice. And next step is this hanging light. Hello! So a lot has changed since I last filmed. First of all, I cut my hair <laughs> and got my roots touched up. And I personally really like it. It's so different. My hair has been long literally forever but very exciting also my parents left actually yesterday morning so i've been in this apartment by myself for like a day and then earlier today the wi-fi guy came so i finally have wi-fi which is great i've kind of tidied up the kitchen and the current living room space but the rest of the rooms are still a little bit questionable but i wanted to kind of show you guys the updates i know i probably should have vlogged them 
as they were happening but alas i did not so i will show you guys the updated apartment and where it's currently at so here is the little kitchen area i still want to style this better i don't think i'm going to actually keep all the plants up there but this is just how it is right now i also need to move these guys around i ended up getting some plants from my balcony and my mom potted them for me first is this borgandelia i think that's how you pronounce it and my mom kind of wove it in this fence thing so hopefully it'll grow bigger and kind of spread along the fence and then i got this plant stand from ross and this pot from home depot and we put this little palm in it as you can see there's a balcony next to mine and the goal was to get a plant that was big enough to give some privacy but all the big palms are really expensive so we just got this little guy and hope that it would grow bigger out here but it's still really cute and i like it on the stand i haven't cleaned this off since my parents left so obviously i'm going to move this trash bag it just has extra dirt in it along with those plastic planters and these are just like my dirty sneakers so i need to move those too i probably should have moved it before the vlog but you know it is what it is so that's the update with my patio definitely still has a lot of work to be done but i think i will make that its own video at some point in time the kitchen is pretty much cleaned up. I cleared off the counters and I think it's looking really cute. Once again, I don't think that I'm going to leave the shelves styled like this. I want to get a bar cart and that's kind of where this stuff would go. But for now, I think it's pretty cute. This is something I'm so excited about. I wanted this table from West Elm, but it retails at like $600, which is just way too expensive for me. But I saw it on Facebook Marketplace for $295 and I offered $250. And then they offered $275. So I got this table for $275, which I know is still a lot of money, but it is a real marble and it matches my dining table really nicely. So I have this coffee table for once my couch comes. Speaking of, I know my pink couch was out here and the plan was to leave it out here until my new couch comes. But basically I didn't know if the couch delivery men would be willing to move my previous couch to a different room. So so my dad just moved it and for the time being i'm just gonna not have a couch out here i don't know what i'm gonna do with this chest yet still tbd same with all the plants they're kind of just miscellaneously <laughs> all over but i did hang this little mirror up here i think it goes perfectly and my plan is to get like a little shelf here to put my keys on when i come in the door so that is my plan with this little area i kind of cleaned off the tv stand i'm debating getting baskets or something to put in here but because this isn't my permanent tv stand i don't know if i really want to spend the money so it just looks a little bit <laughs> cluttered in there i tried to clean stuff out but i will be doing that the rest of the day as well the shelf and the light still looking great the bathrooms are basically the same this is the messiest room of the whole apartment it's a disaster and this is kind of what i'm going to work on after this but i definitely just need to put stuff away and organize it better but this is where the wi-fi stuff went i'm gonna hide that somewhere but my dad also hung my magic neon sign above this but yeah this room i'm not <laughs> you know i'm not proud of it right now and as for my room it's actually coming together i ultimately decided to move my pink couch in here which i'm really happy about because i love it and i can definitely see it a lot more in here i still need to unpack my pillows and kind of figure out the pillow on bed situation but that is for later this is what we're working with <laughs> that bag needs to be put away i moved my tall mirror over here this corner is pretty boring i definitely want some sort of greenery i wanted to hang a plant here but i forgot and last minute we didn't have any hooks so i might try to do that on my own and then i just put this little leaning mirror that i have right up here next to my dresser so that is my current update i really love how it's all coming together but i definitely still have a lot of work to be done so i think i'm gonna end this video here and i will start up my other one make sure you guys are subscribed because you can follow along on my decorating moving new apartment journey as always thank you guys so much for watching and stay tuned for my next video bye